2025 has been a crazy year for robotics so far. As usual, the year kicked off at CES in Las Vegas, where Realbotics stole the show with its hyper-realistic androids that are totally not robot girlfriends. And as China kicked off the year of the snake, 16 unitary H1 humanoid robots performed a synchronized folk dance alongside human dancers during the 2025 Spring Gala Festival on primetime Chinese television. In February, Silicon Valley Unicorn Figure ended its partnership with OpenAI and unveiled its self-developed Helix AI model. The startup is racing to deploy 100,000 humanoids within four years. As Kai Sinat faced criticism for the way he treated his Unitree G1 robot, Chinese startup Booster Robotics shared this extreme stress test footage. Then, Clone Robotics creeped everyone out again with its synthetic human prototype called the Protoclone. In March, Shenzhen-based UB Tech Robotics shocked the world with this footage of a swarm of its industrial humanoids working at his Zeker EV factory. Also in Shenzhen, engine AI robots were seen patrolling the streets with police as the startup's PM1 became the first humanoid robot to front flip. The robot went on to perform in a viral homage to the 2004 cult classic, Kung Fu Hustle, which it also performed for the streamer I Show Speed. As Chinese humanoids went viral for their dance moves, the world-famous Atlas humanoid from Boston Dynamics proved it still had it. In April, Kawasaki captivated the world with its futuristic Koryo hydrogen-powered robotic horse concept that may or may not be possible by 2050. During the world's first humanoid robot half-marathon in Beijing, the city's hometown humanoid, Tiangong, came in an easy first place, finishing in 2 hours and 40 minutes. As Tesla's Optimus faced setbacks amid political fallout and China's ban on rare-earth magnet exports, Xping showed off its iron humanoid robot at Shanghai Auto Week. In May, Unitree held the first humanoid robot mixed martial arts tournament near its new 10,000-square-meter factory in Hangzhou. It was just weeks after Unitree's full-sized robot went viral for the wrong reasons, and this footage apparently leaked from a Chinese lab. In June, the French robotics firm Aldebaran, maker of two of the world's most iconic robots, officially called it quits after two decades. In brighter news, Pennsylvania-based Gecko Robotics reached unicorn status with its wall-climbing industrial robots as a slew of low-cost robotic systems emerged. And David Beckham helped Pepsi unveil its first humanoid robot in China, developed in collaboration with Shanghai's Ajibot. With half the year in the history books, there's no sign of things getting any less crazy. Make sure to subscribe to keep up.